morning, boys and girls, and welcome to another week of Sunday School. We are, have been talking a lot about the different things of fall. We've been falling in love with God's world. We've been going on so many different adventures, and don't worry, we have another really fun special adventure planned for you today. But, you know, I was thinking, we've been reading a lot about parables, which are stories that Jesus has told, and there's one that I found today that I wanted to share with you. It's a story about how we shouldn't worry because we have the biggest and best protector in our life. So it starts out, Jesus said, do not worry about the things you need. You will always have food to eat. You will always have warm clothes to wear. Look up. Do you see the birds? Do you look up and see the birds in the trees? They do not work. They cannot buy or sell or trade. And they have no place to put anything, even if they could. But God feeds them. He cares for them. Just the same. So why do you worry? God loves you more than anything else in the world. So if God takes all that time to protect and take care of the birds, how much more time do you think God will take to protect and take care of you? You know, this time of year, I like to think about a protector. And there is a protector. And every time I look at these, they remind me of God, our protector. I wonder if you can think of a fall thing that might protect something. You see them maybe at a farm, in the middle of a cornfield maybe. They like to scare away certain things and protect. I wonder, boys and girls at home, they like to keep birds and different animals from eating the garden. And this thing protects the garden. Do you guys know what fall thing I'm thinking about? Milo. Or Lucy, do you know what fall thing I'm thinking Scarecrow! about? Scarecrow! Scarecrow! Scarecrows, you're exactly right. Every time I see a scarecrow in a field protecting the garden, I think about God and how he protects us. I wonder, hey guys, do you want to go on a scarecrow hunt with me? Yeah! yeah! Boys and girls at home, do you want to join us on a scarecrow hunt? What we're going to do is we're going to go see how many scarecrows we can find and how many we can find all around Kenosha and see the different things that they're protecting. Come on, let's go. Okay, guys, we are on the hunt for some scarecrows. We're driving down as we go to some different locations where there might be some scarecrows. And we're gonna see if we see any just in the houses we pass. Let's look. Do you see that scarecrow protecting that house? Let's see if we find any more. Let's look around. Hmm. Let's see. Well, I see some harvest decorations over here. There's some scarecrows in the pot there. Do you see them? They're small, but they're protecting that pumpkin. Let's see what else we find. I see pumpkins, but that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for scarecrows on our way to our first location. Oh, check out those scarecrows. They're protecting those pumpkins by the house. Beautiful. 
Oh, and we've got some more over here. Oh, one fell down on the job. Driving along, looking at the scarecrows just in people's houses. I wonder how many more we'll find when we actually get where we're going. Hey. Hi boys and girls, look it, I found one here at the farm stand. Look around. It's protecting these pumpkins. Hi, boys, boys and girls, look, we found another one here at the greenhouse with all these beautiful flowers. They're protecting the flowers. Hi boys and girls, we are here at the farm stand and if you look behind me, there's a whole field of pumpkins and some beautiful things. And check it out, here's some scarecrows you might recognize. We got Mickey and Minnie and scarecrows can look like anything. They're stuffed with hay and protecting and doing their job. And right now these are protecting the farm stand and all these beautiful pumpkins behind me. Come and see these pumpkin boys and girls, come look. Look at this field of beautiful pumpkins. And look at this whole field of scarecrows. How beautiful. How beautiful. Check them all out. Boys and girls, we know that God is always protecting us. He's always above us, watching over us, the same way that these scarecrows watch over the garden. God is always protecting us, and know, and we know that he's there with us. Is there anybody else in your life that might be a protector to you? Can you guys think of people who are protecting you God. and watching you over you? God, who else? Your mom Jesus. And dad. Your mom and dad. Um, Jesus. Jesus. Aunties and uncles. Aunties and uncles are watching over you? What about other people that are watching over us? Can you think of any? Um, lifeguards. Um, lifeguards. Exactly. Police officers, firemen. They are always people. Doctors, nurses, they're all watching Grandma. over us. Grandmas. Exactly. Grandmas and papas are watching over us and grandpas. Those are always protectors that are good to have in your life that are watching over you. And they help show you who God is. Just like these scarecrows help remind us of who God is too. Boys and girls, while we were here at the farm stand, we bumped into some friends. Check them out. There's some funky looking duckies. Come around. Oh, look at all the wild things. Look at all the wild things. Come around here. You like the chicken. Let's go on an adventure. I think we saw it. some beautiful sunflowers. Mm -hmm. Like when we, the first lesson we learned about. Come check them out over here. Hey guys, we did see some sunflowers. Yeah. Check them out. Remember the week we learned about the sunflowers and how when we trust in God, we grow, grow, grow and read our Bible and pray every day. Remember to keep growing. Okay, boys and girls, we're going to go find one last spot where I know there's some scarecrows. Let's go. Boys and girls, on my way to Karate, I found a scarecrow. Look, look at all these pretty flowers. Wow, it's protecting all these flowers and some pretty mushrooms. We found this downtown. And this scarecrow is doing a good job at protecting the garden, right? Uh-huh. All right, we better get to karate. Let's go. Bye. Look at me, look at me. I'm a scarecrow. I'm going to protect my family. This is why God protects you and me. Bye, boys and girls. Remember to like and subscribe.